Now everybody knows in crappy fishing, sensitivity is king. And whether or not you feel the bite or not could be the difference between you getting a limit or catching the fish of a lifetime. So in today's video, I'm gonna be going over a hack that can turn any fishing rod into a crappy fishing machine. Stay tuned. Before this video even gets started, before I show you how to catch more fish all year long, doesn't matter what rod you use, we are running a 20% discount sale on the website. Use code FALL and get 20% off your entire order at checkout. Before we go over how you know you can set this up on any rod you own, we want to first figure out why I wanted to do this in the first place. So what separates you from the fish? When you're fishing, you know, you're sitting there, you're winding in, what separates you from the fish? And that is your line. Now, when the fish bites, the bite's gonna go through this line all the way to your rod and either shake the tip or make a vibration in the line that mentally you know I need to set the hook. I'm gonna show you, you can eliminate some of those steps by basically making it so you feel the bite faster. Thus, the fish doesn't have enough time to either spit it out or get a bad hook set. Because when the fish bites it, the faster you set the hook, the faster it goes in the roof of their mouth and you get a better hookup. You know, the more time that they play with it in their mouth, you could either jerk it out or hook it in the side or even hook it in their lips. And as we all know, a crappie has a paper mouth and you could end up tearing a hole. And if you give it any slack, the fish is gone. So the roof of the mouth is where you want your hook to go. So if you can catch them faster, you get better hookups. What I have here is a five foot ACC crappie stick. Now, in the past, I have complained about not being able to feel the bite with this rod. I love the rod for the power and the flippability of any fish that I catch, but I couldn't feel the bites as I was holding the rod normally. Now, if I put my finger on the line, it doesn't matter what rod I use, I'm able to be directly connected to the fish. But as you're winding, you know, with the new swim bait, or with any jig like a twister tail or a little minnow you know the only way you can feel the bite is through this blank and with acc's blanks they're kind of stiff so the sensitivity just wasn't there for me so what i have done is i measured out where my finger goes on this rod and i actually took as you guys can see I took a razor blade and I cut all the way to the blank. Here and here, I made a triangle with a razor blade. Then I, I took a small Dremel tool and I smoothed it out. Now what this allowed me to do doing this modification is instead of trying to feel the blank through the cork handle, you know, most rods have cork handles, some have styrofoam, etc. But instead of trying to feel that, I put myself in a better situation by being able to have my finger directly on the blank. So I am eliminating trying to feel a bite through the cork handle. And I am getting myself one step closer to being in direct contact with the fish. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little hack. Let me know down below some other hacks that you may do and I may be able to cover on the channel.